Boy, do we have an oil filter treat today. We'll be comparing this 30-year-old AC Delco oil filter, number PF25, against this new AC Delco oil filter, number PF1218. Both of these filters fit the same vehicles, and I got this new AC Delco oil filter at Rock Auto for $3.36 plus shipping, but you may be able to find it cheaper somewhere else. And I bet you're wondering where I got this 30-year-old AC Delco oil filter from. Well, a generous viewer sent this oil filter to me. Yep, a viewer named Scotty Jack Ubin from LaPorte, Indiana sent me this oil filter. Thanks, Scotty. So today we'll go back 30 years in time and see how they used to make AC Delco oil filters. So let's get started. This is a network. You got a really good silicone, a nice pipe. You got your inner ear, filtration, and your inner ear. Okay, let's start with the older filter and we'll start with the box. You got a little picture here of the oil filters. And you could freeze this and read this if you want. All right, and right here, the newest fitment date they got is 91. 1991. So we know this filter has got to be 30 years old. All right, let's open her up to see what she looks like. This sticker we got here made in USA I couldn't find the date code she has five inlet holes metal core with holes and there's something down there below you see that I don't know what that is we'll see that when, uh, when we open it up see what the heck that is Nitro rubber gasket, which is on here pretty good. Yep, so this is a 30 year old filter. Kept it in good shape. It's all nice and clean. Alright, let's look at the new oil filter, the new AC Delco oil filter. It also has a sticker. Now this doesn't say made in USA on it, but we get the date code. 21266Y. Product of USA. She has eight inlet holes. Nylon center core. And I don't believe these have bypass valves. Those are threads on here. A lot of threads. Gasket. Oh, it comes off real easy. Oh, the threads on this other one. Now, this one has less threads. The older one has less threads. Let's, let's look at the gaskets here. Okay. Yeah, I think the new one on my right sticks out a little, little more than the older design. Yeah, you can tell the threads. The newer one on my right has more threads. Well, I say we open these filters up and see what they look like inside. Okay, here they are cut open. And here's the new AC Delco. 405 grams. And here's the old AC Delco, 405 grams. It's funny, they weigh the same, but they're totally different. <laughs> You'll see in a minute. Here's the base plate, 176 grams for the new one. And the old AC Delco is 179 grams. Take a look at these guys, compare them. They're totally different. 
I would give uh, the base plate to the new one, new AC Delco, simply because it has more threads. And, well, actually, it has more inlet holes, too, so, yeah. New, old. The new one has a rubber nitro anti dream back valve, which fits over these holes nicely. Now, the old one has this plastic insert, which goes like this. So it really doesn't serve any purpose except for to make the oil go out to the sides and maybe just to keep everything tight but if you look at this so you got a big space there but no any drain back valve go back to that in a little bit but let's see the filter elements the old one 115 grams and the new one, 124 grams. Let's start with the new one. They got really sloppy with the glue here. And I counted 58 pleats. And there's a seam here somewhere. It's right here. Looks like an inside seam. Metal end caps. And this filter media is a cellulose filter media. With a micron rating, it captures particles down to 30 microns. This space pretty good. The only thing I got, the, kind of an excess glue here, you know, that's about it. Otherwise, everything looks good. And it has stamp leaf spring, no bypass valve. 11 grams. Okay, now let's look at this old AC Delco. Get this focused in. Look at all the glue here. I think this is where there's a seam because I couldn't find a seam anywhere. I counted 36 pleats and these pleats are wavy. A lot of space. They look deeper though, so going to be interesting to see which filter is longer. The one with the more pleats or the one with the deeper pleats. But yeah, you can see the glue right there. No seam. Metal end caps. No bypass valve. And if you look in the can, there's nothing in here. There's no stamp leaf spring, no coil spring. Let's weigh these. The old one weighs 104 grams. The new one weighs 88 grams. The new one's a lot thinner. Get some measurements. Point three eight millimeters thick. And the old one, you can tell it. You can, I can feel the old one's thicker. Yeah, look at the difference there. 0.46 millimeters thick. Yeah. The new one's thinner. And let's get some measurements on these. Get a place where there's no glue here. Okay. Two point eight six inches wide. And the new one is two point nine five inches wide. And that's some glue down there. I seen that earlier. Some glue. Like I said, they are sloppy with the glue on these. All right, well, 
you can see well this one's pretty deep also the right one the new one but the old one has definitely got deeper pleats so I say we cut these filters open and see which one has more filter media what do you guys think I think they're gonna be probably pretty close to tie I don't know, could be wrong though. Be right back. Okay, so here they are both stretched out. And they go over my table. And the new AC Delco oil filter is 86 and a half inches long. And the old AC Delco oil filter is 67 inches long. They're zoomed out. Okay, so let's get some measurements on the thickness. This is my new thickness gauge. Second time I'll be using this. 0.86 millimeters thick for the new AC Delco. And for the old AC Delco. Wow, 1.11 millimeters thick. Quite a bit thicker. Let's check these out. get this to focus here come on focus there it goes yeah you can see the thickness difference here definitely the old one's thicker I don't know what the micron rating is on the old one well let's look at the rest of the filter I opened up this one so you could see this. This is the glue in there. Like I said they got a little sloppy with the glue. So you could see that when you're looking through the, the hole. I'm assuming these are vertically mounted because there's no any drain bag valve on this one. But this one has one, so this one was probably made for other vehicles also. I mean, this is the best matchup I could find. So again, I want to thank Scotty for this filter. It's not every day that I get to open a 30-year-old oil filter. So I think I'll wrap this video up. What do you guys think about this 30-year-old filter? Please post your comments down below. And don't forget, Oil Filter Friday. I open up a new automotive oil filter every Friday on this YouTube channel. So if you like this video, please hit that like button. Thanks for watching, and take care. The new AC Delco filter media weighs 34 grams. The old AC Delco filter media weighs 28 grams.